Welcome back to another Bob Blast. Hi, I'm Bob Burridge, and I'm back in my studio. And what I'm working on is putting on the final finish, the varnish, the final finish on a lot of the paintings and projects that I'm gonna be showing you at Art of the Carolinas. Now, most of you know that I use a liquid varnish on a lot of my acrylic paintings. Oh my gosh, you know, the polymer varnishes, they come from the hardware store, they come from the art stores. Here's the Holbein crystal finish, and that's all the liquid stuff. But did you know I use a different kind of varnish for the more sensitive surfaces? Let me show you. I have here for you Dorland's Wax Medium. This is great on top of watercolors and also my acrylic paintings. I wanted that encaustic look without doing all the encaustic stuff. It's, you know, it's, we all love encaustic paintings, but I wanted that look. And so this is what I use, Dorland's Wax Medium. It's used for oil paintings and, and pigments of powders and things like that. But I use it as a final hand rubbed, then buffed out finish on a lot of my more sensitive paintings, like uh, the pastels and also my watercolors. Let me show you how I do it. Basically, I just take soft, soft paper towels and just like, and rub it in. Just like putting wax on your cars. Oh yeah, like you remember that. There we go. Rubbing it in all over. And I might do this two or three times until I get that soft and caustic look. There's no shine to it. There we go. Then I'll let it sit for a little bit, maybe about a half an hour, and then I'll come back and buff it out. Just like that famous movie, Wax On, Wax Off. There we go. And I keep buffing it until I have a beautiful satin finish. Oh, it's so beautiful. There you go. Big white soft towels. And now it's gonna feel like a brand new car finish. You know, it go reek, 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 and it squeaks, squeaks. There you go. And I'll let that set sit for about a day and then I'll come back and do it again. Maybe about three coats. And that's when it's ready to go out the door. Ship it right to the galleries or to a brand new home. I wanted you to know about Dorland's Wax. Many times we go into an art store, we look at this stuff in the catalog, we have no idea what it does. And I like to show you products that I use in my studio. No secrets here. Hey. Enjoy this. I hope you have fun with this product. It's a great product. Dorland's Wax Medium. Hey, I'm going to see you at the next Bob Blast. See you later. Hi, I'm here to tell you about Art of the Carolinas in November, Raleigh, North Carolina. You, you hear me talk about it all the time, but now's the time. It's coming up in November, Raleigh, North Carolina. It's a trade show. Why go to a trade show? Are you kidding me? First of all, that's where you're gonna see all the manufacturers, all the, the, the products. You're gonna see major discounts. And then there are classes all day long taught by artists like myself, many of us. And we do these short three hour classes, sometimes all day long classes. The materials are already provided for you. You walk in and here we go and we paint. It's fantastic. And then you run out to the convention floor and you buy all your materials at major deep discounts. Where do you think I buy my stuff? This is Art of the Carolinas. You've heard us all talk about it. And, and you can take many classes and my classes, Oh my gosh, I love to go there because I get to meet you. It's, a, it's great fun. Uh, and I'll be teaching like the figures. I'll be doing the uh, three hour classes on uh, quick warm ups. You'll see me doing landscapes, all kinds of landscapes. You'll see me do, be doing, uh, I'll be teaching uh, how to do uh, loose and juicy florals the way I do them anyway. 
color combinations, my figures, on and on and on, and all, all working with my color wheel also there. I have a special class just for that one too. It's wonderful. I cannot wait, and I cannot wait to meet you. I'll see you at Art of the Carolinas in November. Hey, I'm Bob Burridge, and I'm dreaming about my next workshop in Puerto Vallarta in Mexico, having this coffee early in the morning, sitting on my veranda, looking at the ocean. It's one of my favorite places to go. It's Casa de la Artiste, and, you, and you've heard me talk about this. It's the house that we go to, and we stay there, we sleep there, we eat there, we paint there, and just looking over the ocean, it's fantastic. Go to my website, so you can see all the details, but remember, it's in January. January, so hurry up and sign up. I'll see you there.